Uh, this is vlog number two of of Mice and Men by John Steinbeck, and this is character and conflict. There are multiple characters throughout this whole book, and each character has its own has its own conflict, whether it's with themselves, with another person, or with nature. Um, I'm gonna list the characters, which are there's Lenny Small, Curly's wife. George Milton, Curly, Crooks, Wit, Slim, Carlson, Candy, and then there's the boss, which all of them are throughout the whole book multiple times except for the boss. He's he's in there a couple times. He's mentioned by other characters, but he's only he only appears in there once, so I'm not going to go on into a deep basis with him. Um, <coughs> a conflict is a struggle between opposite forces and throughout this book there are three main types that are in it there are person versus person which would be like George or George versus Curly or Lenny versus Curly there's person versus society which let me think an example for that one person versus society would be like Lenny versus um, okay the reason he got kicked out of their own t old town was because he grabbed a person a girl's dress because he liked the color of it and she told the town that she, he had raped her which that didn't happen she he just grabbed the dress and she started screaming so he held on tighter and so society him he was versus society in that is instance because society says it's wrong to do that because it is wrong to do that, but that's not what happened in that instance. And then the last type is person versus self, which means like they have an internal conflict that they're fighting, which is at the end of the book, the one that George is facing, which is George versus George, but I'm not going to say that one because that would definitely ruin the story. Um, the main conflict that I think would be person versus uh, person, because there's a lot of that. Um, there, the main I think a main denominator, a common denominator in all of the conflicts is Curly, because Curly is in a conflict with George and Lenny, and with with George and Lenny and Candy and Carlson. The only one he's the only people that he's not in conflict with is Wit. Oh wait, not Carlson. He's in a conflict with Crooks, not Carlson. He's is Carlson and Wet and Slim. Those are the only ones that he's not in conflict with. So he's the common denominator in the conflict of those. And the main conflict with that is that he feels the need that he constantly has to prove himself because he's so small. And but Lenny, the one with Lenny is Lenny finally gets to the point where he's had enough of it, and so he, grab he's. Basically, he crushes all the bones in one of his hands. He s shatters all the bones in his hands because he kept going and kept going. And then George told him to stand up for himself, and so Lenny grabs his hand and crushes the bones in his hand. And after that, he didn't mess with him again. So that's the main conflict. The main conflict is within is person versus person. And the, the, two, the three main people that it's between is... Curly and George and Curly and Lenny.